Hi, thanks for tuning in to Noir Histoire. I'm Natasha, and the subject of today's Black History Short is Lewis Howard Latimer, born on September 4th, 1848, Virgo, died on December 11th, 1928, notable inventor, nationality, American. Lewis Howard Latimer was the eldest child of two enslaved people who ran away from Virginia. In fear of being recaptured, his father deserted the family when he was 10 years old. Latimer dropped out of school and began working odd jobs to help support his mother and siblings. At the age of 16, he enlisted in the Union Navy and served in the Civil War. Following the end of the war, Latimer returned to Boston and found work at a patent law firm, Crosby, Halstead, and Gould. While there, he taught himself mechanical drawing and worked his way up to head draftsman. In the course of his duties, Latimer drew the blueprints and filed the papers for Alexander Graham Bell's telephone patent. Several years later, he moved on to a position at the U.S. Electric Light Company in Brooklyn, New York. The new role enabled him to experiment with improvements on Thomas Edison's light bulbs. Lewis Howard Latimer expanded the lifespan of Edison's light bulbs by redesigning the filament with carbon. Latimer's knowledge of electricity and lighting resulted in him managing the installation of streetlights in several major cities. In addition to being a notable inventor with contributions to seven patents, Lewis Howard Latimer was also a talented poet, playwright, artist, musician, and teacher. Thanks again for tuning in. If you enjoyed this episode, please click the thumbs up button and share it online. I hope you'll also subscribe and return for future episodes to get motivated, get inspired, and get stories of Black history made and in the making. Until next time, take care.